Smile 2 Review, More Grins Than Screams, The Dark Side of Fame, the horror sequel Smile 2 takes audiences deeper into the twisted world of its malevolent shapeshifting demon, serving up more grins than screams. Directed and written by Parker Finn, who helmed the sleeper hit Smile, the sequel introduces a unique blend of horror and social commentary, especially around the pressures of fame, the original Smile was known for its nerve-wracking tension and grotesque imagery, featuring a demon that thrives on the trauma of its victims. With a sinister smile reminiscent of an internet troll, the creature mocks its prey, turning their anguish into a source of twisted amusement. It's a concept that resonates in our online culture, where masks are often worn to hide true feelings, echoing the sentiment of don't worry, be happy in the face of true horror. In Smile 2, the stakes are raised as we meet the film's protagonist, Sky Riley, played by Naomi Scott. Sky is a pop star grappling with the dark underbelly of her glamorous life, a narrative that feels particularly poignant in today's celebrity-obsessed world. Following a devastating car accident that took her boyfriend's life, Sky's journey toward recovery becomes a canvas for the film's exploration of the pressures faced by those in the limelight. The relentless demands of the entertainment industry and the burden of public expectation become palpable themes throughout the film. Sky's introduction to the demon comes after witnessing a brutal incident involving her dealer, setting off a chain of events that lead her to confront her deepest fears. Her character's struggle is depicted through a series of haunting flashbacks and increasingly surreal encounters with the demon, which manifests as a grotesque caricature of her own anxieties. The film effectively captures the tension of balancing personal trauma with the expectations of a comeback tour, providing a sharp commentary on the music industry's relentless nature. Point one standout scene showcases Sky at a charity event, where a teleprompter malfunction forces her to improvise a speech. With blood-red lipstick smeared across her mouth, she delivers an unfiltered monologue that feels both liberating and deeply uncomfortable, highlighting the thin line between authenticity and performance in a world where every moment is scrutinized, moreover, Smile 2 effectively touches on the theme of celebrity culture's dangers, reminiscent of real-life stars like Amy Winehouse, who faced similar pressures. As Sky navigates encounters with a zealous fanbase and a controlling stage mother, the film amplifies the idea that sometimes, the brightest smiles conceal the darkest truths. That I in conclusion, Smile 2 is more than just a horror film, it's a commentary on the cost of fame and the internal battles many face behind their public personas. With Finn's sharp writing and Scott's compelling performance, this sequel invites viewers to reflect on their own lives, leaving them with plenty to ponder long after the credits roll.